My name is Grace. Today, I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is God's Big Promise. Abraham is called by God. Let's read. Abraham, Abraham lived in Haran. Abraham, God said, I want you to leave Haran and go to another land. God didn't tell Abraham where that was. Trust me. God said, Abraham lived in Haran, and God said to live Haran, and God didn't tell where this. Do this, God said, and your children will become a great nation. How? Abraham wondered. His wife Sarah was too old to have children. Trust me, God said. So God said, "You will have a great nation." And、um, but Sarah and Abraham was too old to have a children. Question: Did God tell Abraham where he was to go? Nah, God didn't tell Abraham where he must go. He told him live Haran. Go wherever I tell you, God said, and you will have more descendants. Descendants. Then there are stars in the sky; they will bless the whole world. Trust me. And God tell Abraham that he will have more descendants than the stars in the sky. So Abraham trusts God. He took Sarah, his nephew Lot, and everything they wanted. He went there. Went where God told him to go. He went to the land of Canaan. So Abraham trusted God, and he took Sarah to his nephew, and everything. They. Had to have. They obeyed God. Question: God said Abraham would have more descendants than they were. Number one, cows. Number three, a coconut tree. Number three, the stars. Number three was the correct answer. When he arrived, Abraham camped at Shechem. God appeared to him. I will give this land to your, you and your children. God said. Abraham built an altar to God there. So when they arrived, Abraham camped at Shechem, and God said, "I will give this land to you and your children." And God, he was he built an altar to God. Oh no! Why is there making a soup again? <laughs> Sarah is keep making a soup there. Traveled around God's promised land. He was glad that he had trust God. 
So he built an al another altar to say thank you God for all he had been promised. So Abraham traveled around the God's promised land. He looked around and so he was so pleased that he had obeyed God's. He obeyed God. We should also obey God. And he was so thankful and made another altar to thank God. Abraham built an altar to God to say thank you for all he had been promised. True? False? True. Abraham was so pleased that he had obeyed God and trusted him. Mm, we have got the star. <laughs> yes, there we read the Bible star. Oh, there's an activity. Mm, color the story. Maybe we can color the sky first. This color? Mm. Yellow stars. Mm. Oh! The sky has been built. Yellow. It's hard to color. Oh, it's so hard. Wait. Uh, this is more better. And a brown. Oh. <laughs> You can color these things. Hmm. Ah. It's hard to color it. <laughs> oh, yellow cow. <laughs> Mm, we can get this color to the cow. Hmm. Mm. Mm. <laughs> okay. Yesterday I read the Bible story. Did it enjoy? And next time I'll read another good story. We should obey God. Then let's see you next time. Bye.